The spokesman, Colonel Lampal Gabriel, said Machar's men, quote, repulsed the aggressors after armed forces led by rival General Simon Gatwich Dwal instigated an attack on their men. Machar's SPLAIO forces killed two major generals and at least 27 enemy soldiers while they lost three men. On Wednesday, leaders of the military wing of Machar's SPLM said that they had deposed the rebel-turned-politician for failing to represent their interests. The fighting could put pressure on the already fragile 2018 power-sharing deal between Machar and his old four president Salva Kiir. Allies of Machar on Friday dismissed the attempt to remove him as a failed coup, insisting he was still in full control of the party. Now, Machar himself this week accused what he called, quote, peace spoilers of engineering his removal. The 68-year-old shrewd leader has survived years of bush warfare, attempts on his life, and stretches in exile, served as vice president alongside Kiir in the first government after independence from Sudan in 2011. But the pair fell out and Machar was sacked two years later. Troops loyal to each man turned their guns on each other, and South Sudan descended into five years of civil war. In 2018, however, they called a truce and struck an unlikely and fragile power-sharing alliance that has been tested from its inception.